What's up movers? It's Lacey. This is a move with intention session. Today we're going to be focusing on wrists and ankles, something a little different. Thank you to our DJ Brandon Hickey for the music. We love it. We're going to get started right away. We're going to just open up the chest, pull those shoulder blades together. We're going to work on getting our hips loosened up, working on our ankles, stretching out our toes, something that we don't do very often. I feel stretching the wrists, the toes, the ankles, but it's super important. So go ahead and do this a couple of times through and then meet me down in child's pose on your mat. Go ahead and lift the fingertips. You're gonna feel an even more intense stretch when you do. Lifting and lowering, move at your own pace here. This is gonna be right, raising the scapula. Okay, we're gonna feel it in the shoulder blades. Come into a plank either on your knees or on your toes and then take it back to child's pose here. We're gonna rotate through this a couple of times. Curl the spine as you come forward. You're gonna try to open up each vertebra at a time, like a wave is moving through your body. Go ahead and lift, come to the side. If you wanna go ahead and do a modification, one knee is planted, or you can go to the progression and have both feet on the floor for your side plank. We're gonna repeat this a couple times each side. You can go ahead and keep that knee planted or lift Back to child, nice and easy here. When you come into plank each time, I want you to imagine you have a tight pair of pants on, so squeeze that belly button to your ribs, to the back of your back. Try to squeeze it in tight. And back to child's pose here. Make sure you're breathing through all of your movements. Awesome job, guys. Keep working it out. We're moving on to the other side when you're ready. Nice job. Remember, you can do assisted, so keep that knee planted, or you can lift and be in a full side plank. Roll through the spine as you come up. Breathing, hand can come overhead. Working on a little bit of torso rotation as well. Planks are awesome because they are full body. We're doing some side planks, so this is strengthening our wrists. This is an awesome movement to start the day. During the day, if you have a stiff, achy back while you're sitting at work or at the end of the day before you go to sleep. Roll forward. Go ahead and switch to the other side. This time we're gonna bring the glutes down towards the ankle, lift up into our side plank. And then if you can straighten out your feet, we're gonna straighten out our feet so they are firmly planted on the ground. And if that's a little too intense, please stay in the side plank, either modified with your knee planted or with both feet on the floor. You can see here, we move into side plank. You're gonna bring the opposite foot around, plant it, come back down. And like I said before, if you wanna progress with me, heels, we're gonna have the butt go down to the heels and we're gonna straighten out our posture, planting both feet into a bridge. You can do a bridge if you wanna do a bridge or you can stay like we were before with both feet, both heels firmly planted, hand on the floor and then come back to our child's pose. Remember, don't move into anything that is painful, but if you feel you have the range of motion and you wanna give it a try, Go ahead and give it a try. Just be very careful, be gentle. Don't force anything. You can see here that you can even be in a crab. You can start from a crab as you rotate around and then lift yourself up into a bridge. And then you can go back to your crab or you can simply drop to the floor nice and easy and come back up to sitting and back into child's pose here. Awesome job, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Go ahead and do this as many times as feels good. And I can't wait to see you back here soon. Have a wonderful day and keep moving with intention.